Anna Faris in denial about son's developmental issues after traumatic premature birth. The medics informed Anna Faris and Chris Pratt that their son could have some development issues after they welcomed the baby two months earlier than expected. The actress has now revealed that her now five-year-old son's birth was very traumatic for her. In her new tell-all titled Unqualified, Faris wrote that she was in denial about the baby's potential health issues for a while. She went on to say that she had tried to get pregnant for about a year when she finally found out she was expecting at the age of 35. She recalled how her pregnancy was really nice and she enjoyed it despite her age and the risks that come with having a baby so late. Then, on the morning of August 10th when I was 30 weeks and one day I woke up at 2.15 to a massive gush. The bed was soaked and even though I felt the fluid coming out of my vagina, I smelled it to make sure it was not pee. I was completely unprepared for anything dramatic like that. I called my abs office and I will never forget the way the on-call doctor said, very calmly, S-O-O-O-O-O, you need to go to Cedar Sinai. Right now. Following the phone call, Faris was still in denial about the fact that her baby was on the way. She thought that after going to the hospital, she'd be back in a few hours. The medics gave her a lot of magnesium to stop the labor and it was excruciating. After seven days of being on bed rest, one morning, she started cramping really bad. Jack was held in the NICU for nearly a month. On the fourth day of the infant being there, the doctor told her the bad news, that the baby had some brain bleeding and that he could grow up to be developmentally disabled. They wouldn't know for certain until after he turned 18 months, however. Fortunately, today, he is a happy five-year-old full of wonder and mischief. He still has a couple of physical problems, but we count ourselves as extremely lucky, the mother revealed.